weapons that is used in the market or in the shop. Here we go. Now, if you look at it, you really want to ensure that before you start using this balance, it is well, um, it's pretty much accurate. Now there it is off. So we want to ensure that it's not off, it's dead on center. So we are just going to accurately balance the scale. So is it on zero now? Let me look. You don't want to read it sideways. Remember parallax. Now the red marking here at the top, that represents the kilogram. That's the SI unit. And the black marking indicate the imperial measurement that's found. So to use this, all that we'll do is to hang something on this, and then this is what would happen. And we can take the reading from there, and usually it is recorded in a table. Now, the calibration as to the scale, these little writing here we refer to them as scale, that is very important. What it is saying here is that for each of this mark, represent one ounce and 50 gram on the outside remember if you're going to be finding the mass of anything and it's in a container you need to subtract the mass of the container from the total mass to know the mass of your specimen